Okay. So this is a typical polling station in a mosque in Tehran. It's not unusual at all to vote in mosques here. It's actually quite classic. As you can see, the police is here to make sure everything goes smoothly. Now we are in the entrance lobby. In this lobby, because vote is segregated, women vote on one side and men vote on another. So this lobby here is reserved for the voting of women. As you can see, it is women taking care of all aspects of this vote and also women voting. Now, one thing which is quite surprising as well in Tehran is that there is no secrecy when it comes to the ballots. The ballots are filled on table here, tables here and people write down what candidate they've decided to vote for. As we enter the main prayer room, which is reserved for the vote of men, you can see here it is a 100% male team taking care of this vote. And you can see here people register, their passports are checked, and then you move to the actual voting itself. Now, one thing you have to do once again is to fill your ballots. And the ballots are filled here. On this wall, you have all the names of the local candidates, because this is also a local election. And we also have, this is an amusing little detail, but uh, you can see here the live position for France 24, because we are actually live from this specific polling station right now. And, well, people simply vote in these ballot boxes. And you can see this is the main prayer room with the portraits of Ali Khamenei, who is the supreme leader here, and his predecessor, the founder of the Republic, who is Ayatollah Khomeini. They are present everywhere. And of course, they are important religious and political figures here in Iran.